I'm back. I'm back. I am back with another video. This is another day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. He didn't have to wake us up early this morning, but he did. And I am so glad he did, allowing us another chance to get it right. Oh, hallelujah. I thank you, dear Lord, for another day. We're going to get right into it. The victory is won. Then I, John, saw an angel coming down from heaven with the key to the bottomless pit and a heavy chain in his hand. He sizing the dragon, the old serpent, who is the devil, Satan, and bonded him in chain. That's Revelation 21 through I will read the whole thing. It is good to know not only that our Father God knows the ending from the beginning, and but also that the victory has already been won. No matter how dark things get on this earth or how challenging times we face in our lives, the Lord has already written the end of the story, and it is a glorious circumstantial of his plan. Satan game plan has already been devoured and destroyed God's children to keep them from their destiny. That's his job is to devour destroy God's children. That's his job. Since he can't be God, he constantly oppress all those who are precious to the Father and tries to throw God's plan and purpose. He endure to blind unbelievers to the truth. He aimed to distort and focus of Christians by bringing such tribulation and sorrow that it throw them off their game and they lose hope. That's his purpose, is trying to throw us off our game and lose hope and purpose. So he come in to try to deflect sorrow and Tribulation, and we have to go through. Satan has only a limited amount of time before buzz and sound, so he play hard. He just got a small time, so he going to come in there throwing things hard at us. Perhaps he has bought spiritual oppression or injury to you, but it can't kill you. Oh, yeah, sometimes we have to go through surgery, aching pain. We have to go through sorrows and, you know, tribulation. That's the, that's what he tried to throw to us, injury, you know. No matter how many times Satan strikes at me and you, remember, the final score is already flashing on the board. God wins. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. As this passage in Revelation described, one day Satan will be thrown out of the game altogether. But until then, now we play the play, now we play is critical. Souls are at stake. If we work together. And pray for one another. We will. I mean, we all are strengthened as a as we depend on our victorious Lord and King. Let me encourage you to understand that the true oppression is not people or circumstance. But rather an enemy who know he has already been defeated. 
Don't let don't let him get the best of you. Shoot for the goal. Keep focusing on the prize. All the while rejoicing that God had secured the victory. He had already won the victory. That's what the devil wants to do. He wants to destroy us. The victory has already been won. Whether we have to go through cancer, high blood pressure, you know, COVID and flu pneumonia or aches and pains, you might have knee surgery, back surgery, all that. Yeah, that's the devil's job to inflict you on pain or on your job or anything you have to go through. But know that the victory is already won. God had already wanted Jesus, when he sent his son Jesus to die for our sin, the victory has been won. Satan's job is to steal, kill, and destroy God people if he can. But know that God had already got it made. So the next time you have to go through my knees hurting or my back hurting and stuff, I'm going to still praise the Lord. Hallelujah, Lord, because I know the victory is already won. Next time you get COVID, you get sick, you sneezing and you sniffling, or you going through whatever you know you have to go through, know that the victory is won. Satan's job is try to steal, kill, and destroy, but God has already won the victory, and he can't kill you. He can't do nothing unless he allow by God. So the next time you're going through, praise him. Sickness and pain, praise him. Your bills do, you don't know what to do, praise him. Your children acting up and then now you don't know what to do, praise him. Jesus, blessed Savior. He's worthy to be praised. It just don't matter. you going through on your job. Praise him. It's a new year. Praise him. We ought to get better now. Praise him. Praise him. He allowed us another chance to do it right. Jesus. No matter what the devil throw your way. Blessed Savior, he done already been defeated. He's worthy to be praised. Know that the devil can't do nothing. The victory has been won. Thank you all. I pray that you all have a blessed and wonderful day. Happy New Year to you all. God bless you. God keep you. Jesus loves you so, so much. And so do I. And I will see you on the next video. And I am out.